What is up, all you try hard gamers? Da 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 da! I unlocked the Federal Corvette, and let me tell you, every minute of it sucked unlocking it. <laughs> uh, basically, long story short, you've got to go to Canopus, uh, which is a system, and do cargo missions ad infinitum, and courier missions ad infinitum, and Canopus. Uh, has a station, the station you have to go to, is 44,000 light seconds away every time you jump into it. Yes, it sucked horribly, but the payout was amazing. This ship, in my opinion, um, with regard to a combat ship, is far, far, far superior to the cutter, my friends. Far superior. It's so superior, in fact, that it allowed me to do a build that I've been wanting to do for a long, long time. So let's get into it. All right, core internals. If you can, I say this all the time. I never have the money to get it. Get the reactive surface composite. Okay, this thing is a beast. You want it. This thing is nimble on its own anyway. Uh, but get the reactive surface composite. Though, if you do encounter something that can drop these shields, you better be running anyway. So... <laughs> 8A power plant um, overcharged, 7A thrusters, dirty drive tuning, 6A frame shift drive. I would um, mod this for range if I were you because the one downfall of this thing is that it does suck for range. 5A life support, 8A power distributor, important charge enhanced. I always say that. Um, 8D sensors. Okay. Oops. All right, on to the optional internals. 7A shield generator. Look at our shield strength. We're almost at 6K. Granted, regular shield generator, you're going to get um, a lot less recharge. You're going to have to weigh that. I wanted to see how high I could get the shields on this thing. And I don't even have prismatics. So we are far and above what the cutter was at. Uh, close to 6k shield strength. This thing is a beast, okay? As you can see here, I've got a bunch of Guardian Shield reinforcement packages, 6a fuel scoop. I do have a Guardian um, frame shift drive booster. Uh, the rest of them are Guardian Shield reinforcement packages. Very, very simple. Um, so yeah, that's, that's very simple. Advanced docking computer. You can go without this if you want, if you want to fly it through the mail salon, it's really up to you. So let's move on to the utilities. Of course, shield boosters. Now I opted to do two thermal rather than three. I was reading a little bit about, uh, diminishing returns. So, uh, two of them are modded with thermal resistant shield grade four and thermo block. The rest are heavy duty and super capacitors. And then I have my handy dandy kill warrant scanner as usually because as everyone knows I'm a bounty hunter. Now, all rapid fire pulse lasers. I've been, you've heard me talk about this. I've been wanting to do it for a while. I just have not found it viable until this ship. Let me tell you what makes this build viable on this ship. Number one, the distributor is pretty decent, right? But number two, you've got two huge hard points here, which offsets some of the low damage that it would otherwise do to the hull. We are just blasting these fools out of the sky with these rapid fire pulse lasers. They are amazing, every single one of them. Are, I believe up to grade four so what you what you're about to see uh, in the combat is not even grade five yet this is just grade four it's absolutely insane um, so as far as flying this ship the ship is far more nimble than the anaconda it's a hell of a lot more nimble than the cutter is I've got more shield strength out of it and more firepower I am overly joyed absolutely overly joyed with this ship this is going to be my new main ship um i think i think i'm gonna be flying this thing for a long time you guys are going to see a lot of builds with it so that's it stay tuned for the combat portion 
of this build video and thank you guys so much for the support you guys have been awesome I've been getting subscribers left and right you guys have been getting me views getting watch time hours everything so thank you so much we